stayed with me throughout was <clears throat> there were explicit threats made to firstly Emmanuel and to some of the rangers. Um, I wonder, did you guys who were basically taking some covert footage, were you ever scared that you might get uh, involved in this? Because some of that footage, if they if they even found one of the cameras, maybe there could be some consequences there. What was your personal sense of risk and risks you were taking? I mean, there, there was there was a number of, of risks. I think I think the war was actually a lot more scary in the, <laughs> than the, than the, but but I mean, in terms of the of the investigative work, um, sure, it would you know it would have been dangerous if maybe we'd been found of hard drives. But but really, it was Rodrigue and, and Melanie and a number of other br very brave fishermen and civil society members who were actually really on the front lines, risking their lives, um, and Rodrigue especially because. Melanie was very brave, but she could, leave. as a foreigner, she had a degree of protection. And Rodrigue and his family are based, you know, they're there. And and so, you know, if, if he was caught, he's, he's risks a lot, a lot more. And then, you know, talking just of risk, the Rangers uh, risk their lives every day, and 140 of them have died protecting this park in the last 20, 20 years. So, 